drink with me tonight Let's go to far off places And search for treasures bright Come drink with me tonight Let's build a giant airship And sail into the sky Let's watch the ground so far below Let's watch the birds as they fly by Fly so high Come dream with me tonight Hey, that was a wonderful drink. Hey, thank you. You're welcome. <laughs> Sorry I couldn't help you find that guy you're looking for. Guy? Oh, yes, the hairy who's it? I was sure he lived around here somewhere. However, no sense crying over spilt... Uh, uh, spilt... Uh, Milk? Oh, oh, no, thank you. I just had a hot drink. In any case, I must be going now. Well, it was real nice of you to drop in, and I hope you find that feller, the, the hairy who's it. Who? Oh, you mean the, the whiskery whatnot. Oh, how I wish I'd found him. Yeah, Princess Arugio will be terribly disappointed. You know Princess Arugia? Know her? Why, I'm practically her uncle. Uh, or is it cousin? In any case, I have served the royal family as a messenger for countless years. What was the message you were supposed to bring from the princess? Well, I, I suppose I could tell you. Uh, now, what was the message? Oh, yes, yes, I was to invite the uh, follicle flipper to gibbet to King Nogbert's castle, along with uh, Teddy, Grubby, and Gimmick. Teddy, Grubby, and Gimmick? Say, I know those guys. We rescued Princess Arusia together. You did? Well, that's quite a coincidence. Uh, what was your name again? I'm the Wooly What's It. Well, why didn't you say so? You are hereby invited to a, a royal banquet. Me? Invited to a bank... bank... A banquet for helping rescue Princess Arosia from the evil mudblups. Or was it the evil Gatangs? In either case, it'll be held on the fourth day of the seventh month, Grundo Savings Time. Gee, that was three days ago. It was? Oh, well, maybe there'll be some nice leftovers. Uh, I must be off. Hey! Uh, uh, how do you get to the castle anyway? Well, it just so happens I'm going there now. I usually remember the way. <laughs> Do you mind if I tag along? I don't see why not. That way, when we get there, you can tell me how we did it. Father, can you hear me? Our friends have asked to see you. I regret this painful incident had to occur. It has rather spoiled the celebration. Never mind that, Your Majesty. We just want to see you get better. Father, Gimmick has an amazing new invention which I thought you'd like to see. Yes, I call it the portable duplicating machine. It, uh, uh, it duplicates things. I'd love to see a demonstration. Yeah, well, of course, if you insist. Now, what shall I uh, uh, duplicate? I have just the thing. Now, if everyone is ready... Oh, me. Oh, my. Uh, Gimmick, don't you think you ought to turn it off? Oh. Yes, it would seem that after duplicating the peanuts, I, uh, uh, Whoa. neglected to turn off the automatic repeater switch. I can't find the switch, Gimmick. <gasps> oh. Uh-oh. Hang on, everybody. Oh. Yikes. Whoa. Uh, has anyone seen my uh, uh, spectacles? Are these them? <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, Gimmick, at least we know for sure that your machine works. Yes, and thank you for showing it to me. But these duplicate bracelets will disappear soon. Isn't that right? Uh, yes, Princess, uh, but the effects of the machine seem to be lasting longer and uh, uh, longer. 
I'm afraid I must ask everyone to leave now. The king needs to uh, 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 rest. Yes, my friends, I'm feeling quite tired. Hey, Twink, would you mind painting a wall instead of me? Why as hell be? Or you'll give us away. Don't worry, no one would take us. <laughs> Never mind the bad jokes. We must sneak into the king's chamber. Huh? One side, a royal painter's huh? coming through. <laughs> Great galloping grungle nuggets. Look at all that gold. So what's that got to do with us? Don't you understand, you chowder-headed chump? This time we're going to be rich. I've heard that before. You too? What are you doing uh, uh, here? We're uh, that is why we uh. Go ahead and tell her, Twiz. Uh, we're gonna be rich. I'm glad you're here. Please hold this uh, uh, stuff away. Huh? And please hurry. The king must have uh, 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 rest. You heard the lady, Twiz. Move it. <laughs> yamma, yamma, yamma. <laughs> hurry up, LB, before the price of gold drops. Oh, just wait till I show Mummy these jewels. And when Quella sees them, he's sure to make me a member of the Monsters and Villains organization. If he sees them, you mean? After your mother gets her hooks on him. Hmm, you may be right, LB. We'll go straight to Marvo headquarters instead. Now move it! Oh, great! Now I gotta hold this thing up the mountain. How oh, very odd. Those two painters have left the castle without asking for payment. Uh, you certainly do have loyal subjects, Your uh, 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 Highness. Excuse me, Your Majesty. Huh? Ah, oh, Doctor, what news of my husband's condition? There is now no doubt that the uh, uh, grundleberry juice that the king drank was a uh, uh, poison. Is there no antidote? Yes, but we have less than 24 hours in which to uh, uh, administer it. Otherwise... What is the antidote? Where can it be found? Unfortunately, it is a rare uh, uh, flower that only grows in one place. The jungle with no name. The jungle with no name is much more than a day's distance from here. And you uh -huh. said my father has but 24 hours to live. I have an idea. Well, we could take the airship. That's right, Teddy. We'd get there in no time by flying. And it'd be easier on our feet. Uh, yes, that's a most excellent idea. But if you take the airship, the Gatangs may attack the castle again. Hmm, there is that, uh, uh, possibility. It sure is getting to be kind of confusing. But without the antidote, Father will die. Don't worry, Arusia. We'll get those flowers from the jungle with no name and defend the castle at the same time. We will? I mean, we sure will. <laughs> How are we gonna do that, Teddy? I've got a plan. If we continue southeast from the castle, we should be at the jungle with no name in just a few hours. Gee, Teddy, I hope you're right. But I think you're wrong. What do you mean, Grubby? Look. Gatangs! Princess Arusia was right. It would appear to be another uh, 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 raid. More like a full-scale invasion. Yeah. And some of those Gatang planes are getting mighty close to the airship. Indeed. Air full speed on the air, uh, uh, propeller. More fuel in the furnace, uh, Teddy. Faster, Grubby! How fast is faster when you've already run out of time? Wow! Wow! Oh my! Ooh. Oh no! We've been hit! <gasps> oh my gosh, we're gonna crash! Hang on, everyone! Oh. Grubby, Gimmick, are you alright? Yep, I think so. Maybe we should have walked after all. Indeed. I believe I have sustained only minor injuries. The airship, however, appears not to have fared as well. I see what you mean. Hey, fellas, look. There's King Nogbert's army now. Yes, and just in time, too. <laughs> <laughs> now they've really got a fighting chance. It's a good thing you thought of making all those duplicated soldiers, Teddy. I just hope they don't disappear too soon. Well, if they do, 
Gimmick can always make some more, right, Gimmick? I'm afraid that might be a bit uh, uh, difficult, Grubby. What do you mean? It appears that the duplicating machine suffered some damage during our crash landing. Oh, no. <laughs> this is serious. If the duplicate soldiers disappear before they can drive off the detainees... <laughs> soldiers at all. That gimmick guy just duplicated or cupelated or made more of them. There's hardly any real soldiers here at all. <laughs> I've got to single the Gatang to come back. Where could he be going in such a hurry? I haven't the foggiest notion, but he's headed for the top of the tower. And he's carrying a lantern. A, a lantern. lantern! I'll wager he's planning to signal the Gatangs to resume their attack. Come, there's not a moment to lose. Wait! Stop the retreat! Get ready to launch a new assault! You there! Stop in the name of the king! And stronger than ever it would appear. Grubby, do you have any of that root stew left? Gee, Teddy, we used it all up during the last Katang raid. Gimmick, are you almost finished fixing the duplicating machine? Yeah, I'm afraid it may take a while yet. Uh-oh. What do we do now, Teddy? Wait for a miracle. Hello? Uh, quite a lot of commotion, wouldn't you say? Mr. Old Beanley. <laughs> and me! Hiya, fellers! Look out, everybody! Hey, you guys! Cut that out! You could hurt somebody! Now I'm getting kind of mad! Wow! Attaboy, Wooly! <laughs> No way to make friends! You guys have to learn to play nice! What's telling them, Wooly? Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Hip hip hooray! Oh, gee! Once again, my friends, I am in your debt. Your duplicate soldiers confused the Gatang attack, while Wooly here demonstrated his incredible bravery. We did what we could, Prince Aaron, but I'm afraid we failed in our real mission. 
Yeah, with the airship busted, we can't get to the jungle with no name in time to save the king. Tell us, Doctor, how much longer will my father live? I'm afraid he's fading at, at, at fast. This is all my fault. If only I had realized that Jester was a spy. And if only we'd been able to get to the jungle with no name in time. Yeah, we could have got those flowers that would have saved the king. Hey, that reminds me. Here's some flowers I picked for you, Princess Arusia. Why, thank you, Wooly. Wooly, where did you find these? In the jungle with no name. Yeah, may I see those, Arusia? They appear to be the species Floridinus midisoma. Uh, 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 do you uh, concur, Doctor? Uh, yes, Newton, I believe they are. There's no time to lose. I'll make the antidote at, uh, at, at once. Oh, Wooly, thank you. Huh? Thank you. Shucks! I only picked them! I didn't grow them! <laughs> <laughs> What is a woolly? What is a woolly? What is it? What is a woolly? What's it? He's bigger than a haystack. He's bigger than a house. He looks like a gorilla or a giant furry mouse. He doesn't seem to have a single clue from where he came. And so the woolly what's it became his only name. Now Wooly's heart is just about as big as it can be. And I am sure that he is also great big mentally. <laughs> so say hello to Wooly and I think that you will see. He's just a big pushover. And a friend to you and me. Four hot! Two, three, four, hot, two, three, four, hot, two, three, four, halt! Who goes there? I have important news for Quilla. I must see him at once. No one sees the supreme oppressor without my permission. Marvel Rules and Regulations, page 16, line 12. Even if he's carrying this? Hmm. I suppose rules are made to be broken. Come with me! Yes, but Nostro Club, what is it now? Treasure your wickedness! Stolen from right under King Nogbert's nose by Tweed and his pudgy accomplice! Treasure, you say? What can it be? A handful of paltry jewels? A measly nugget of gold, perhaps? No, no, your vileness! Look in this bag! Oh, if we must. Mm, a mildly interesting haul. Thank you, thank you. And there's more outside. Well, bring it in at once. Your wish is my command. <laughs> well, it'll be. I hope you've learned a lesson from this. A twist. Planning, brains, and wickedness. That's the way to succeed in this world. Yeah, but boss. Don't interrupt, LB. Can't you see I'm gloating? <laughs> this treasure has made me feel as light as a feather. <laughs> that's good, because that's about all it weighs right now. What are you talking about? This sack is filled with... Yikes! <laughs> Tweed, I'm told that your membership dues remain unpaid. This paltry treasure of yours might just cover the expenses. Hand it over. Treasure? Yes, those trinkets you showed us earlier. Oh, that treasure. <laughs> yes, well, you see, it, um, uh, LB here took it. With what? The miserable wretch doesn't even have hands. <laughs> nice try, Tweeb. I'm warning you, the penalty for lying to the supreme oppressor is quite severe. Take them away! b, -b, -b i didn't lie! It was here a moment ago, it just, just vanished! Volume 27, Article 23, fourth line down! Anyone interrupting the Keeper of the Door while reciting the Marvel Regulations is liable to an even stiffer penalty! Keep it up, Tweez, you're on a roll! 
Too bad it's all downhill. <laughs> a bountiful harvest of nutritious peanuts. This is truly amazing. Yes, it is. Thanks to Gimmick's duplicating machine. I sure hope these peanuts don't disappear like all the other things did. Uh, now that they've actually sprouted, I should think that's uh, 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 highly unlikely, uh, Grubby. I wonder if that means the duplicating machine works better on some things than on others. It could be. On the uh, uh, other hand, it might mean that my adjustments were uh, correct. No matter what the reason, my friends, this gives us cause for hope. For that, even more than for the gift of my life. We thank you. We shall be eternally grateful.